The SR-71 Blackbird is a legendary aircraft that has captured the imagination of aviation enthusiasts and the public alike. Developed by Lockheed Martin's Skunk Works Division, this remarkable reconnaissance aircraft served the United States Air Force from 1966 to 1998 and remains an icon of aviation engineering. Designed in the early 1960s to replace the U-2 spy plane, the SR-71 was built to fly at unprecedented speeds and altitudes. Its sleek, futuristic design featured a distinctive long fuselage, sharply pointed nose, and twin-engine nacelles. The aircraft was constructed using titanium, which not only provided strength, but also allowed it to withstand the intense heat generated during high-speed flight. The SR-71's true capabilities lie in its speed and altitude, with a top speed of over Mach 3, three times the speed of sound, and the ability to reach altitudes of 85,000 feet or more. It could fly faster than a rifle bullet and higher than most enemy missiles. To achieve these incredible performance parameters, the Blackbird utilized powerful Pratt and Whitney J-50A engines, which employed a unique afterburner system for sustained supersonic flight. One of the aircraft's most distinctive features was its ability to expand while in flight due to the extreme heat generated during high-speed operations. This heat expansion would seal any potential fuel leaks in the aircraft's fuel tanks, which were common during the aircraft's early days. The SR-71's reconnaissance capabilities were equally impressive. Equipped with state-of-the-art cameras and sensors, it could survey vast areas and produce high-resolution imagery. The aircraft's operational altitude and speed made it nearly invulnerable to enemy interceptors and surface-to-air missiles, earning it the nickname the Hebu after a venomous snake found in Asia. However, despite its extraordinary capabilities, the SR-71 was not invincible. Advances in satellite technology and the development of unmanned aerial vehicles eventually reduced the demand for manned reconnaissance aircraft. The high operational costs associated with the SR-71 program eventually led to its retirement in 1998. Over its operational history, the SR-71 Blackbird set numerous speed and altitude records, demonstrating the pinnacle of human engineering and aeronautical achievement. It also played a vital role during the Cold War, providing intelligence on potential threats to national security. Today, several SR-71s can be found in museums across the United States, a testament to the aircraft's enduring legacy and the dedication of the engineers, pilots, and support personnel who made its remarkable performance possible. While it may no longer patrol the skies, the SR-71 Blackbird remains an enduring symbol of the ingenuity and courage of those who pushed the boundaries of aviation to new heights.